Hey everybody, it's Garrett over here at Corporate Fitness Works. I'm over here at the Asperia Fitness Center and today I'll be teaching a Dirty 30 formatted class. Uh, for today's class, you guys, equipment I'm gonna be utilizing, first and foremost, gonna be a step here. Okay, we're gonna have some quick step work. We're gonna have some feet elevated work um, to add a little bit of range of motion. So if you guys have a step about um, six inches to maybe a foot and a half or so off the ground, you guys can get that. Um, if you guys don't have that available, you guys can use stairs, or you guys can just perform the movements that we're doing from the ground. Okay, other than that, I will be using a um, at least one set of dumbbells. I, I brought two out just in case. Um, so if you guys have a set of dumbbells available, grab those. Um, they don't have to be too heavy as far as weight goes. Um, you can keep it more lighter to moderate weight. Uh, maybe get a couple sets out if you have those available. Um, and then other than that, guys, we'll just be using a mat today. Um, in general, guys, the, today's class, um, it will be a, um, as far as the formatting for it, we're gonna do 12 different movements. Those movements are gonna range from upper body specific, lower body specific, to either core or uh, speed cardio work. All right, so getting a nice total body workout as a whole, okay? Um, lots of these movements, for the most part, are going to be body weight, minus a few that we're going to use those dumbbells for. All right. Um, so yeah, we're going to do three rounds. Tabata format, like I said, we'll be performing each movement, each 12 exercise for a period of time. Okay. The goal behind this, guys, is we're trying to go full time with each movement. Okay. So that's why we're keeping it lighter weight. That's why we're doing a more body weight. Um, it's because we're trying to... Um, increase our metabolic levels, okay? Trying to increase uh, that metabolic intensity, all right? So try to uh, push through, okay? If you need to, feel free to take breaks here and there. But like I said, we'll do three rounds, uh, 12 exercises, gonna go 20 seconds on each movement, okay? So nice and quick, nothing too crazy. And we're gonna have 10 seconds off in between to transition and get ready for that next movement, okay? Like I said, try to go full time if you can. If you can't, uh, catch your breath real quick, but then try to get right back after it. Because like I said, uh, once that 20 seconds starts, we're pretty much going to go through that nice and quick, get right into uh, that next movement. All right. Um, so yeah, guys, all, uh, before we get into the workout itself and before we get into our warm up, I'm going to quickly go over each of the 12 movements. That way uh, we have a good idea of what we're doing prior to our warm up and then once we're done with our warm up we're ready to just get right into that workout all right um, so yeah guys as far as that workout goes like i said um, gonna do some speed cardio movements upper body lower body and core okay starting off guys we are going to be starting off with a speed cardio movement okay um, this is going to be off of the step all right uh, this is going to be forward quick steps, okay? So we're perpendicular with that step, with that bench, okay? Uh, here, guys, we're going to do a two on, two off forward sequence with our steps. So what I mean by that is we're going to be perpendicular with the bench, okay? We're going to go two on, two off. So stepping up right, left, stepping down right, left. Okay, uh, there will be a halfway dinger with um, the time. Okay, with this exercise, I really want you guys to make sure that we're switching that lead foot. So if you're uh, starting off leading with that right leg for the 10 seconds, I want, as soon as you guys hear that dinger, we're gonna start switching with that left leg. So leading with that left leg, two on, two off. Okay, when you guys are doing this, make sure that we're staying in this nice quarter squat position. All right, and also make sure that we're using those arms to help generate that movement, okay? The arms are both going to help uh, both upper body wise and lower body wise speed up that movement and to um, keep up with that uh, natural locomotion, okay? Um, second exercise, guys, we're gonna go on, uh, on the mat here, high plank position. We're gonna be doing plank shoulder taps. Okay, so high plank position. Here guys, focus on keeping those hips nice and low full time. 
Make sure as we're reaching to touch that shoulder that we're not opening up those hips to the sky, okay? Really make sure we're keeping them nice and low and parallel to the ground. Keep that core nice and tight, all right? Third exercise, guys, we're gonna do a lower body movement, okay? Feet elevated up on the step to start. And here, guys, we're just keeping our feet up here full time, alternating, doing a reverse lunge. So here, guys, we're just gonna add a little range of motion with that added step. So as you guys do this, big step back, front foot's gonna stay on that step, lunging down, back to that starting position, okay? You guys can just alternate reps out for this, or just like that first movement, you guys can do um, that first side for half the time. As soon as you hear that dinger, do that other side for half the time, okay? You can do either or for that. All right, you guys can also load up for this exercise, weights on the side, uh, barbell on back, or you guys can have a dumbbell in that goblet hold right in the middle of your chest. All right, fourth exercise here, guys, we're gonna be in a bent over row position, high hips, flat back. Here, we're gonna do bent over rows, okay? Uh, if you guys have dumbbells, go ahead and do, um, uh, obviously, both together. If you guys just have a kettlebell or you just have one singular weight, you guys can do reps on one side and then, of course, halfway dinger. Make sure, make sure we're getting that other side. All right, fifth exercise, we're back to the step here with more speed, more cardio work with feet switches or ollie shuffle. It's another term for this, okay? But for this, guys, same thing. We're in that quarter squat position, so a little bit of a bent knee situation, staying in an athletic position, okay? Here, guys, we're gonna start off one foot on the step, okay? Make sure it's just that front part of the foot, okay? You don't need that full thing on there, okay? So front part, that ball of your foot on the step, okay? Quarter squat position, got that other arm up, helping to generate that movement. And here, guys, we're just hopping, switching our feet like so, okay? All right, use your arms to help generate that movement, okay? The quicker you're doing up top here, the quicker that lower body positioning is going to be. Okay? Sixth exercise, guys, pretty straightforward on this. We're going to do push ups. Okay? So nice chest movement, tricep, shoulder movement here. Okay? Um, you guys can do this from the ground. You guys can do this um, if you guys need to from a modified position, either doing it from your knees. Okay? Or we're doing it in a higher up position, like say off a bench, from the wall. Uh, some type of incline position to help out, okay? If not, if you guys wanna challenge yourself a little bit more, you guys can do clap push-ups, you guys can do uh, wide or narrow or diamond push-ups, okay? And then uh, also you guys could do your feet up on a surface, on a, on a chair or something like that, um, in that downward decline position and do decline push-ups, okay? All right. Seventh exercise here, guys. Uh, we're back to the step, okay? Once again, lower body movement, we're gonna do feet elevated side lunges. Okay, so once again, guys, here we're gonna get a little added range of motion down at that bottom off of the step. Okay, here once again, you guys can alternate this out or half the time we're going one way, half the time we're going the other. Okay, here guys, big emphasis as you do these lunges is make sure that you guys aren't, number one, stepping out too far. Okay, so if you guys are up on this step, we're out too far, you won't be able to sink down, okay? That's not the goal of this movement, all right? Really want you guys to make sure we're getting that step out, but that we're also able to sink down into a nice low position, okay? Make sure you guys set those hips back behind you before you squat down into that outside leg, okay? Eighth exercise here, guys, we're doing another core movement with high plank, plank jacks. Okay, so hopping those feet out in that high plank position. Okay, uh, if you guys wanna modify this, you guys can just stay in that high plank position and we're just gonna alternate toe taps. Okay, all right, so getting those hip flexors engaged, getting that core engaged. Make sure you're staying nice and flat. Make sure that those hips aren't elevating up in the air. All right, ninth exercise, guys. Once again, we got another lower body movement with drop squats, okay? If you guys haven't done this exercise before, uh, starting position, we're gonna have our feet right underneath us, okay? 
Uh, this is going to be a little bit more of a narrow stance as opposed to shoulder width. So feet tight together. Here we're hopping those feet out into a comfortable position. So either shoulder width or slightly outside of that. Sinking down into a low position, low squat. And then we're popping back up into this starting position. Okay, so it's going to look like this. Popping out, sinking down, bop back to the top. Okay, just alternating that out. All right, you guys can also use your hands here, touch the ground, okay, make sure we're staying low, all that good stuff. Okay, staying bouncy, adding a little plyometrics to it. All right, 10th exercise here, guys, we're grabbing our weights, hitting some curls. Okay, so some bicep curls. You guys can do any type of variation you want for that. So hammer curls, you guys can do that supinated curl, um, you can do zopping curls, uh, 21s, whatever you guys want for that. Okay, barbell curls. All right, just trying to get a nice per, uh, curl pump. All right, 11th exercise. We're using those weights again here for some side or lateral raises. Okay, so here guys, focused on that outside part of the delt. Okay, that lateral aspect of the shoulder here. Okay, uh, make sure you guys aren't swinging those weights. Make sure we're controlling them. Coming down nice and tempo on the way down. All right, 12th exercise here, guys. This is gonna be a fun one. This is gonna be a reactive movement, okay? Where we're starting off, uh, as soon as we get queued up for that last movement, I'm gonna say hot feet, okay? Hot feet's just gonna indicate what? Hot feet, okay? So here, guys, hot feet's just gonna mean this, so nice and choppy, okay? Uh, I'm gonna give you guys four different directions, okay? If I give you guys a... Uh, I need to figure this out. So this is my right, this will be your guys' left. If I point and say left, okay, you guys are gonna give me a quick hip flip. Okay, if I point to the right, same thing, it'll be a quick hip flip to the right. Okay, if we're pointing up, you guys are giving me a vertical jump, right? And then if I point down, you guys are gonna drop to the ground, give me a burpee, drop the chest down, pop back up, okay? As soon as you guys do one of those movements, you're back to that hot feet position, getting them chopping. Okay, so I say left, back here chopping. Say right, here chopping. Okay, point up, hit that vert, get back to chopping. Okay, you guys are gonna react to whatever I am sending you your way. Okay, so a little fun to wrap up this little Tabata workout. All right, uh, but those are the 12 movements, guys. Like I said, nice upper body, lower body, speed cardio, and some core. Okay, we're gonna do three rounds total, all right? And that's all we got, okay? All right, so before we get into that, guys, real quick, we're gonna get right into a nice little warm up. okay? Let's start off, just starting off this upper body position, okay, getting those shoulders warmed up, all right? So let's go ahead, guys, palms to the ground. Let's start off with some small forward circular rotations. All right, make sure you guys are progressing with those circles increasing that range of motion. Let's go ahead guys, progress all the way, get that full range of motion going forward. Okay, all right, awesome guys. Next up, we're gonna go palms to the ceiling. All right, we're gonna go that reverse motion and we're still starting off with small circles to begin with. All right, once again, guys, increase that range of motion as those shoulders get a little bit more loosened up. And then eventually, let's go ahead and open up that range of motion to its fullest. Good. Awesome, all right, guys, get some arm swings, arm hugs in here, okay? Add a little toe tap movement. Let's link up that lower body to our upper body. Okay, all right guys, next up, we're gonna be doing some toy soldiers. All right, so if you guys haven't done these before, basically these are gonna be uh, walking leg swings where we're keeping that leg straight as we swing up. And then with that opposite hand, we're meeting at that top position, okay? You guys should feel that hamstring getting dynamically worked. And with that opposite foot, we're extending on that down toe simultaneously to get that calf stretched out. Okay, 
Um, so you guys can walk these out, keep them stationary. Uh, but let's get 12 toy soldiers, okay? 12 soldiers, you guys, or 12 toy soldiers, I should say. You guys can um, count up your reps here. Next up, we're going to do a alternating forward lunge into a side twist, side twist, bend, bend. Okay, so here guys, big step out, we're going to twist, twist, bend, bend, all right, go back to the top, that'll be one rep. Let's go ahead, get a total of 10 total reps, okay, so just alternate it out, twist into that knee. Bend away, bend into it. All right, let's get that thoracic spine, get that lower body engaged. Four. guys. Okay, the last thing we're going to do here for our warm-up, we're going to link up that upper body and lower body here with walking inchworms. Okay, so here guys, feet, or uh, hands, we're starting off nice and tight to the feet. Walk those hands out into that high plank position. Hold, then we're just going to tiptoe, keeping those legs straight to the top. Yeah, that's one rep. Let's get five total reps in. Alright guys, uh, that's going to conclude our warm up. Alright, we're going to get right into that workout. Starting off with those forward quick steps. Remember, two on, two off. Okay, stay low. Alright, switch that lead foot halfway through. Need some water real quick. Alright guys, get ready here. Round one guys, let's get it. Alright, let's get it. At the top, forward quick steps. We got plank shoulder taps to follow. Five seconds. Two, one. Let's go. Let's go, guys. Use those arms. Switch that lead foot halfway. Okay, next up guys, plank shoulder taps. Next up, feet elevated, reverse lunges. Go guys, big step back here, keep that chest up full time. Okay. 
Next up, guys, bent over rows. High hips, flat back. Step guys, feet switches. Okay, one on, one off. Use your arms to generate speed. Let's go. Elevated side lunges up next. Next up, plank jacks. What's up next? Bicep curls up next. Next up guys, side or lateral raises. we got here guys hot feet reactive work okay I point to there flip split up jump down burpee let's go guys get him chopping get him up let's go to the left to the left to the right to the right up down down and up Okay guys, all right, we're gonna take a quick 30 seconds off here. All right, minimize the rest, get water real quick, recollect that breath, okay? Round two coming up, back to those forward quick steps in front of that bench, two on, two off. Get water, get ready to go.
right, guys. Round two. Back to the top. Forward quick steps. Let's get it going in 10 seconds. All right, get focused. Get ready to go. Five seconds. Two, one. Let's go, guys. Remember to switch. Lead foot halfway. Switch that lead foot. Next up, guys, plank shoulder taps. Let's go. Next up, feet elevated reverse lunges. Okay, next up guys, bent over rows. Next up, we got feet switches. Next up, guys, feet elevated, side lunges. Jack's up next. Let's go. All right, drop squats up next. up curls. Alright. 
Side or lateral raises up next. Make sure you're getting hydrated, get that water, recollect that breath. One more round left to go, all right? Get ready to go here, guys. Back to the top with those forward quick steps. All right, guys, one more round left to go here. Get that mind right, get that body right. We only got one more round left to go. You guys can do it. You can finish. All right, four quick steps to start, guys. Let's get it ready. Switch lead foot halfway. Let's get it going. 10 seconds. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. Let's go. Stay low. Use those arms. Switch that lead foot. All right, next up, guys, plank shoulder taps. Guys, feet elevated, reverse lunges. Let's go, guys. Big step back here, alternate it out. Switches up next. Next up, feet elevated side lunges. Right, 
Next up, plank jacks. Next up, guys, gonna do drop squats. we got today hot feet react and work all right get chopping react let's go guys let's go to the left to the left to the right to the left up let's go down chop and chop 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 go down chop 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 to the right to the left to the right up and we are done Okay, well, that'll conclude today's workout, guys. As always, be sure to stay hydrated, get some protein intake, some type of snack before and after any type of high intensity workout like we just did, okay? Make sure you guys are stretching it out, okay? Get a nice cool down in, stretch out any type of, any area that you feel may have been affected in this workout, all right? Get some nice stretching in, guys. As always, I appreciate you taking the time watching these videos, all right? This will be my last one for a while, guys. I appreciate you, all right? Hope you guys are doing well. Hope you guys are staying safe. And until next time, guys, take care. Garrett, signing out.